Hey everyone, Nick here, and I'm here to talk to you about this really cool thing I did yesterday. Um, I decided to try out for The Voice, or audition for The Voice. So I kind of want to talk to you about the process and kind of what was going on throughout the whole thing. Um, to start, I had to create an, uh, what was it, a artist account, and then I signed up for the city and the time I wanted to try out at. And so I selected Detroit and the 11 a.m. group. So I got to line probably like 10 30 10 40 I was in line and just chill like just going over the music trying to get everything ready um, I also found out you need two songs ready and I only had one so yeah that was also another thing I had to do but we were talking or the group in front of me were talking you know didn't really talk because I was one nervous to just kind of get into it and kind of make sure I was ready to go but once we got through the first like section of waiting, where family, so we got to the second section waiting, where family and friends cannot come in unless they're your guardian if you are under the age of 18. I kind of joined in, and these people were really cool. All of them, uh, they all, each started taking turns singing, and wow, guys, their sound was wow. And then they came to me, and they're like, aren't you going to sing? I'm like, nope. Um, truthfully, I was intimidated and scared of being laughed at because they were all so cool um, and I'm still torn between songs I finally figured out the second one but we started going kept talking a little bit and then finally we get to the uh, where they separate us one more time into six different lines luckily enough I was put into the line with one of the girls who was in the group we were talking to so it kind of made me feel a little more relief because I had someone I kind of was talking to and kind of friends with at this point point. it was easy for me to talk to her just to not you know, get worried. So we kept talking. She's really cool. Um, just getting you know, to know each other. And we finally got up. They checked our IDs, our tickets and stuff. And then luckily enough, I was still in the same group after the next proceeding. And so I sat right next to her. And it was really cool. So we kept talking, you know, just kind of keeping each other busy. And just not to worry about stuff. That was going on. You know, because I was worried about the singing completely. and But, you know, it was really cool just sitting there talking with her. Uh, and truthfully, she kind of helped me make sure I didn't take the out and leave before my audition. So I do want to thank you, Whitney. You are awesome for that. Because if I didn't talk and become friends with you, I probably would have left because I would have been in my own world the whole time. So thank you again. Anyways, yeah, so me and Whitney were just chilling and talking, getting to know each other, having a good time, laughs. It was really fun. And then finally we started walking around. Uh, you know, uh, what do we do? Fuck, we walked up and down some stairs because there really wasn't much to do in the big Kobo Center we were in. Because they had us in like this little tiny room, or in this one big room with nothing. And there was no plug, so we were trying to find a plug to charge our phone. So we finally found one, charged a little bit chilled out over there and then off. Uh, yeah, we went back and instead of walking and then her phone died again. So instead of walking all the way back to where we were, we decided to go right outside the men's room where one of the other plugs in near at least in the near vicinity was working. So we just chilled there talking and then some guys showed up and they were all just singing. It was really cool listening to their sound. So I've yet to sing at this point. Um finally I had to walk away, warm up, try to get myself to like how I sound, and I finally did, and finally I sang it, and I, I guess I sound better than I thought, which was really cool, um, so, yeah, we finally went back to our seats, because, you know, they take forever to get from one group section, they have to go in order of groups and stuff, but I mean, when he went back to our seats right before our groups are going, uh, yeah, and this one guy named Lee, so, Lee, if you want, if you post any of your work in the comments below or a YouTube channel or anything you've worked on you know what anyone can go see it then but yeah I hope you post some of that stuff but yeah Lee talked to Whitney about doing like a big music thing and then he talked to me about doing a country song with them I'm down for it I'm looking forward to it um they need more help with that other one that she, he was talking to Whitney with I'm down for that too because crap I love singing and I know I can sing more than just country but country is just where my heart's at for most of the songs I sing. But that's just a side note. Anyway, so yeah, me and 
when he just sat there. We were lucky, and then we got up. We were in the group of ten together, at least two for that. So yeah, they pull people out ten at a time, and then once you get to the audition room, the ten singers sit in the center. Anyone who is under who is under the age of eighteen, their guardian has to sit on the side, and we took turns singing. And by shuffling the things around, I got the first song, so I had to sing first and. My nerves were still going, but it was a little calmer after like talking with people, singing, and they were giving me compliments. So it was nice to have that. So I sang, just stutter, or did mess up the words a little bit because I was, like I said, I was nervous. Never done this, but I did it. And guys, I'm glad I did it because if I would have taken that out, I would have probably regretted it. And I'm glad I didn't. And if also. I'm glad I did it too because I made made some really cool pe met some really cool people made some really cool friends and they're all awesome and I'm hoping to keep in contact with all of them hopefully we hang out with them stuff like that but yeah so sadly I didn't go on but a 15 year old girl did for sure and then a girl another girl who was under 18 might have she she got her number taken down by the judge so hopefully. She got that callback, but she had till 9 p.m. to hear back from him. Otherwise, she didn't. So I really hope she got the callback. Because she was fantastic, and she was sick singing. Um, yeah, so neither, So Whitney, like I said, she was in my group. She didn't make it either. But she has a phenomenal voice, and she has a passion for it, and wants to go somewhere with it. And I really hope she does. Because it would be awesome to see her up singing, performing. And so, Whitney, if you're seeing this, if you want to post links to those two music on SoundCloud, in the box, in the comments below for people can check it out that'd be awesome and thank you but yeah so as we're leaving like I said talk to Whitney a little bit and hopefully we're gonna keep talking stay in contact and go hang out a couple times but regardless I am glad I did what I did and I'm glad of the people I met and again thank you Whitney because you know you if I didn't talk to you I probably would have left because I would have been I, w I wouldn't have thought of myself as good, and I probably wouldn't wouldn't have even attempted it, but you helped me out a lot, so thank you so much, and yeah, uh, anyone who watches who I talked to at The Voice, hope you did well, hope you made it to the second round, and also good luck to all of you in your future singing endeavors, maybe I'll see you in another audition somewhere, never know, maybe I'll keep doing this, but yeah, so if anyone out there watching this th th thinks, you know, I love singing, want, you know, I would love to see myself progressing in it, make a career out of it, do it, guys. You know, I, you know, I did it because I love singing and I have passion. And if, you know, something comes out of it, awesome. But for me, I'm not looking for that. I'm just wanting to try something new. But I met a lot of people who have that passion, who wants to see it go somewhere in. You know, they're so much better at singing than I am, and they deserve to see that happen. And so, just do it. Don't say you can't or you're not good enough. You can do it. Trust me. If I can do it, you definitely can do it. But, with all that being said, look forward to uh, Minecraft videos. I'm cleaning up a prank right now, and that's taking forever. So, I have the first part recorded. I have to finish cleaning before I can do the second part, but be on the lookout for that. As well, like I said, Lee, uh, he talked to Whitney and myself about doing different collab and stuff. So look out for those videos. If I find out links for them, I'll post them, do video about it. Just because it would be, it's going to be fantastic. I can just tell. And as well, check out for in the comments in the section below for my friends' channels and uh, live stream accounts. And in the comments below, if anybody from The Voice posts things they have such as songs, music, YouTube channels, check them out guys. They were fantastic singers and I hope to hear them again and I hope to keep in contact with everyone I met. So with all that being said, you guys have a great day and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.